Alright, what's up guys? So I just got back from the thrift store and I'm kind of in awe right now because I kind of found this golden gem in the diamond in the rough or whatever you want to call it. I found this really nice jacket. I'm just really confused on like why this is in the store. It's, it's new with tags and it's worth like $600. So this jacket, the brand is Fossenob or however you say it and it's from the south of France and if this is new with tags and I'm looking right here and the MSRP is um, $595 so I'm like you would spend that much money on this jacket and not even wear it I mean I'm glad I found it but like wow I, you know I respect clothes that much like when I buy it, I'm gonna wear it I buy it for a purpose but um right now let's just get into these um, pickups I went to a thrift store found some really nice stuff some I'm gonna sell on eBay and some I'm just gonna keep Right here, like I said before, it's this Fastenob, um jacket. On the tag, it says XXL, and it says R slash RE, so I, I don't know if it's like whatever, but it's this blue, this blue jacket. You see kind of some nautical print in here, kind of like an anchor. You have a green trim, which is really nice. Um, it zips um, three, like three-fourths of the way and the rest is without zip and it has buttons right here for more adjustment and you have this clamp right here on the collar it's a really nice jacket I uh, tried it on and it fit really nice but this is worth five hundred dollars like well retail price that is but so what I'm gonna do with it I'm just gonna I'm gonna resell it uh, I'm gonna I have to do some more research on eBay to see what kind of price range I'll be able to get for it, but um, yeah, this Fossenob jacket, it's really nice. I'm gonna see if I can get maybe listed somewhere at 300 or so, and you know, this is gonna be it when it sells, it's gonna give me a great profit. And so, like I said, you guys should get into reselling clothes, just go to the thrift store and look for the nice brands you guys are into fashion, so you know what brands are nice that are popular. So, just look into it, you know, buy low and sell high, that's how you make a profit. Alright, for our second item today, we have this vintage Tommy Hill figure long sleeve. It's um, a polo, a polo shirt, um, polo rugby. Um, so it's basically a block color shirt. So you have a sleeve that's red, you have a panel that's green, panel that's beige, panel that's blue, red again, and you have a panel, a blue sleeve. And on the back, uh, the same pattern continues. This is a size large. It's a pretty nice shirt. Uh, I'm, I might contemplate keeping it, but uh, I was looking on eBay, and they sell around forty dollars. The vintage Tommy Hilfiger stuff. The new ones kind of sell for a lower price, but the vintage ones are the one that's most sought after. So this is another nice find that I'll try to flip for a nice profit. So I'm gonna have this listed up for thirty-five dollars or so, and we'll see what happens. And it's a size large vintage Tommy Hilfiger um, polo. Alright, we're still bringing on the heat. So we have a Brooks Brothers size large um, long sleeve shirt. And this is a very nice colorway because you guys know purple is my favorite color. So I might actually snag this. But Brooks Brothers is another really great brand. They make um, ties. They make really nice dress shirts and they sell for a nice price and this color is beautiful and it has a nice uh, you have white and um, also green checks on it so uh, I can probably go for around forty dollars or thirty five as well somewhere around between sorry excuse me thirty to forty dollars but um, uh, if this doesn't sell I'll definitely snag this for myself because I think it's a beautiful shirt So for right here we have a Joseph A. Bank size large dress shirt. Um, actually, it's not a dress shirt, but uh, it's just a shirt. Excuse me. Uh, it's a really nice print. You have you have your green and blue kind of kind of plaid plaid kind of style to it, and it's a really nice. The material is really soft. It looks like it doesn't really wrinkle that well, so that's really nice. I know Joseph A. Bank um, is local around here in Ohio, and uh, I know the prices are really high, so I have to do some more research on this, but um, I think it's worth a pretty nice penny. 
and I only got it, I think I got a half off, so that's a really good deal. It's another beautiful shirt, really nice colors, and also has an Oxford collar. All my eBay knowledge I've learned on my own as well, but I also follow a guy on YouTube called Rake and Profit. And what he does, he just sells clothing as well. He has a he makes probably seven thousand or so a month by just selling clothes alone. And he just got into an office space, but he has this product called Blazing Profit. So he tells you all the information about blazers and sports coats and how to flip them and make a really nice profit. I don't have that myself, but I've learned from some of his videos about sport coats and. Sport coats are basically one of the best things to resell to make a profit. Because I found this for like $5 and like on average they'll sell for like $50. And if you have the higher end brand you'll, you'll get into like the 200 and 300 range. But this is just a basic model and it's still bringing a nice penny. This is a Stanford sport coat. Nice material. I think this is blue. And I'll probably go around 60 bucks for this. I was only in there for six or seven dollars, and actually, no, I got this half half off, so like three dollars. So that's still a really nice profit. So guys, I'm just, I'm telling you, like if you want to make some extra side cash, looking to selling and um, clothing from the thrift store or even retail arbitrage from going to like a Macy's or so, get the sale or clearance stuff and just selling for a higher price. But sport coats, they're kind of, they, they'll sit for a while, but when they do, man, you, you get like a Benjamin or two and, oh, God, <laughs> money. <laughs> I have another sport coat for you. Um, this one's a two-button sport coat, and it's actually pure, oh, it's, oh my God. <laughs> it's actually pure wool, so that's really sought after. It's really heavy and warm. For the winter months, when you, you know people want to go out to church or whatever, you'll wear this, and I think. Um, but yeah, this is a nice sport coat as well. Um, I'm still new to selling sport coat, so I, I, let me stop trying to say the price range. But uh, this is definitely over fifty dollars for sure because it's pure wool. So that alone will make it the price a little bit higher and sought after. Um, the brand is Lord Patrick. Traditional J.L. Cox, Erie, PA. I'm not too familiar with that brand, but this is a very nice quality sport coat, so I think it'll sell well. So for our last item, we have the St. John's Bay Extra Large, Extra Tall Vest and orange with the black collar and size. So really nice piece to layer in the winter um, it's maybe not that cold just have like a you know a hoodie under here or whatever and just put this on top vesture coming in a lot and this is a nice piece a nice vibrant color if you want to add some color to your wardrobe and yeah this is my last item and yeah so I had a really great day at Goodwill today it was 50% off on the yellow tag so this was 50% off and a couple other stuff that I got were 50% off and you know, I just had a great time, found a lot of stuff. Uh, I left some nice stuff there because I thought I, um, I didn't have enough money, but it turns out I did. I was just tripping. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Comment below your favorite piece that you saw today. And if you uh, want interested in any of this stuff, I'll put my eBay link in the description below. Where you can just check out all my items that have on my eBay page. But alright guys, just stay with style. Peace.